I think these two groups of ants are having a war. Uh, looks like they're fighting in there. So it seemed like a good time to cover them with some diatomaceous earth, which, uh, yeah, it looks like they're fighting, I suppose. But the diatomaceous earth isn't really poisonous. What it is is it's tiny, ground up old sea life, you know, mollusks and, and uh, uh, I guess clams, oysters, whatever. It's very sharp. It's like a coral reef. It's, it's very sharp. It's like microscopic razor blades. And it cuts the ants, cuts their exoskeleton uh, as they walk over it so that they can't retain their moisture. And I, I actually used this at the base of a tree where larger ants had gone into the tree. And after a few days, I just saw a clump of mush inside the hollow of the tree, which I guess was the, the ants dying. So it, the stuff works. Uh, again, it's not poisonous per se. However, you don't want to get it on sensitive parts of your body like your eyes and that because, again, they're like tiny, tiny little... Uh, microscopic razor blades.